We've had about 700 property damage claims, just State Farm that is, in the state of Pennsylvania, and a vast majority of that has been in your viewing area. That State Farm agent says insurance claims are still coming in after last week's flooding across central Pennsylvania. He says right now is the prime time for scammers to try to trick you into signing up for a repair service that you might not need and might not get. Fox 43 finds out the only way to stop the scammers is to do your own homework. Basements are still drying out after flooding in parts of central Pennsylvania. And while people are waiting on repairs, experts want to make sure those people aren't getting scammed by shady contractors claiming they'll fix your home and then don't deliver. I would say a majority of the people I've spoken to, they've never had water damage before. Steve Horning is an insurance agent with State Farm. He says most homeowners and renters insurance policies typically do not cover flood damage, meaning a lot of the repairs may have to be paid for by the homeowner. He says there are things people can do to make sure they're paying for some real work to be done. One th warning sign as a homeowner you should watch out for is unsolicited quotes. Horning also says to get your quotes in writing and make sure you get more than one quote so you can compare what the repair can cost. A red flag could be a company is asking for a full payment in advance and double check to see if that company or contractor has a license with the state. If you're in an area where there's been some flood damage, also watch for signs. You know, you'll see companies from out of the area posting yard signs around the area. Call me for a free quote. The insurance agent says when your insurance does not cover something, you really have to do your homework to make sure you're not wasting your money. You just have to watch out for price gouging and promises that they can't deliver on. In a situation like this, remember that the good companies are going to be busy. So have an open conversation about how long the process should take and call around. Also, know that if a company can't make it to your house for a few weeks to get the work done, that does not mean it's a scam. It could just mean they're busy doing legitimate work. We've had about 700 property damage claims, just State Farm that is, in the state of Pennsylvania, and a vast majority of that has been in your viewing area. And you can expect more on how to outsmart the scammers. We have information on our website about how to make sure you don't end up buying a damaged car after flooding like we've seen here in central Pennsylvania. You can find that information at fox43.com. And if you have a story you want me to look into, Fox 43 wants to find out. Let me know. Send me a message on Facebook or shoot me an email at fox43finds out at fox43.com.